Welcome to the Original Gangsters Podcast. I'm your host, Scott Bernstein. This is going to be part two of a quick hitter edition bonanza this week, talking about the wars up in the Great White North. Blood Family Mafia, Hells Angels, that feud, that war, which was said to be over, uh, clearly is not. We reported last week about the shooting resuming um, about two hours north of Montreal and Suganay. Um, now we have word of more shootings that took place in South Quebec uh, out of uh, Frampton, where uh, two Hells Angels affiliates were shot by members of the Blood Family Mafia. They are now in custody. The two affiliates survived. They were members of the Red Devils Motorcycle Club, which is the main uh, support club for the Hells Angels. Ice Pick Termel, the boss of the Blood Family Mafia, I'm told, is back on the run. Let's also shout out the Dirty News again, who is always on top of this. They're the best true crime blog in all of Canada. They were, they've were been reporting on all the most recent developments, so I give all credit to them for a lot of this. I just followed up. Uh, I just follow up a lot of my sources and try to color it up, but all of this is, is a lot of, I should say a lot of this, most of this is all coming out from the Dirty News. Uh, Ice Pick Termel is still going from a safe house to safe house, has a half a million dollar contract on his head put there by the Hells Angels, um, allegedly. He's been on the run for almost a year now. First fled Canada because of a, a, a an indictment, a drug uh, a racketeering gangsterism indictment. But then this winter um, from Europe, ordered the kidnapping of a Quebec City Hells Angel, Mario Bananas Auger. Uh, his relatives were kidnapped, held for ransom, had their toes and fingers and ears cut off. Allegedly, that has led to the half a million dollar contract being put on Tremel's head by Marty Robert. This is all a kind of shadow war between the Blood Family Mafia and the Hells Angel in Quebec City uh, happening behind the, the the marquee war between the Rizzuto crime family, the Sicilian mob in Montreal, and the Hells Angels in Montreal. Um, David Icepick Tremel, the, this guy's got balls the size of <laughs> the Rock of Gibraltar, uh, 27, 28 years old from Quebec City, uh, consolidated all the drug and street gangs in Quebec City to push back on the Hells Angels 10% tax went and through a cousin of the Rizzutos got an introduction and got their backing for this war that's been going on for over a year. Now it's out there uh, that Termel has responded from the half a million dollar contract on his head and that he now has a hundred thousand dollar contract on Mario Banana's head. Um, and that, while that contract was going out from Europe, Termel was on the move again um, and that he could be in Morocco right now. Uh, had been in Portugal, Rizzuto safe houses. Um, the Rizzutos have been hiding in Portugal, Spain, Sicily, um, and now allegedly Morocco. Uh, Mario Bananas allegedly went to Portugal twice in the last six, seven months, once to uh, give a peace offering back in late 23, um, did, never got an audience with Termel, went back on a plane. And then allegedly after his relatives were kidnapped, a whole contingent of Hells Angels led by Mario Bananas, including guys that be uh, belong to the Tupac Atna crew, um, guys that belong to the Hells Angels in Quebec City, the Hells Angels in Montreal, went hunting for Tremel uh, in February and March. Auger came back, met with police, announced that his war was over with on Canadian soil. That wasn't saying anything about the contract on, on uh, Tremel's head in Europe. Everybody thought the war in Canada was over with between the Blood Family Mafia and the Hells Angels in Quebec City, but it it only lasted about a month. Uh, Mario Bananas was locked up uh, on a on a drug case. 
about a couple of weeks ago. And then in April, the shooting started again. So, you know, this thing is ever evolving. Um, still don't know what to make of this. There are three dozen blood family mafia uh, that are locked up. Uh, people thought that the ranks had all been depleted. Tremel on the run, Tremel's right-hand man, um, uh, Ruben Denis, uh, was apprehended in, in Lisbon, Portugal a month or two ago. But apparently they have guys that are either blood family members, blood family, blood family mafia members that are spread out across Canada, or sorry, I should say spread out across Quebec, um, or they have guys in these other regions of Quebec that want to rep blood family mafia and just fight their battles for them. But um, last thing I will say that the shootings of the Red Devils uh, at a Red Devil clubhouse where blood family mafia members were arrested near the scene, guns and buckets of gasoline. They had been sent there to, to set the Red Devils clubhouse on fire um, and this happened at the first run of the year for the Hells Angels in Quebec. Marty and the Hells Angels in Montreal uh, leading the way. And uh, in, in the middle of the run, you, you have this shooting. So we'll always keep you updated here at the OG. Please like, subscribe, and share. This will give you, we, we're giving you two, two doses of what's going on in, in Canada. I guess it's like when you turn on the news every day and they're talking about the war in, in uh, Palestine or the war in Ukraine. We're going to give you the war in Canada. Scott Bernstein, OG Pod. I'm out. Mm -hmm.